What is up, people of Earth? This is Monkey Man, and thank you for joining me in a special episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Monkey Desert server. And it's a special episode because... <gasps> look at Look, things are falling from the sky. It's a special episode because the update has launched. Whoa, what was that? With all the Halloween stuff. And there's amazing new things to go discover. And I wanted you to come on this little journey with me to go find out what's going on around the, the map. This is the first time I've loaded it up, so it's the first time I got like a... A good look at what's going on here. Um, a little bit of an update. I've been working on the dragon pen, and it's coming along pretty nicely, I think. Let me see if I can grab Bullwinkle here. You get a better look, or a better uh, look at it here. I've made a whole bunch of... Well, I made the second level, of course. It took like a mazillion more walls and a mazillion more adobe railings, but I also added like an extra layer of ceilings and then some ramps so that it's easier to land the guys on the top level so we can just fly right in there and land them and then I turned all of them around you can just walk right in there and turn them around no problem but now they're all nice and neat we got six of them there and then we got another our seventh one uh ascendance I think it's our highest level ascendance yeah outside of the pen that we use more regularly than these guys but now they should be all safe their heads and tails aren't poking out like they used to be and yeah they are out of the way, so it kind of frees up a lot more space around the base to do more things, build more stuff, and something's attacking me. Do you guys hear that? Oh, look, the trees are orange. Let's go get, let's go grab an RG real quick. Oh, first things first. Let's take a look at what Ingrams we got going on. We got the new Halloween Ingrams that we can learn. Ooh, pumpkins. Decorate your base with this pumpkin can be carved with all manner of paints. Sweet. I think we have some paint, don't we? We might need to make some more paint. Where is... Where am I? Okay, I got confused for a second. We got a little bit of stuff in here. Not very Halloween-ish colors. So we'll have to make some... Well, we got, like, cantaloupe. Is that a Halloween color? We're gonna need to make some more paints, most likely, um, in order to decorate some pumpkins and stolen headstones. A headstone stolen from a graveyard and a scarecrow. Decorate your base with a scarecrow. Guaranteed to scare the crows away. Good thing that all the crows... Wait. <gasps> Let's scare, like... Um, I wonder if it'll scare like these guys. Are you guys considered crows? You vultures, but you kind of look like, eh, I don't know. I forget what crows even look like. Are those the only new Ingrams that we have to learn? Let's see. I think they should all be at the top there. I wish there was like a little, like, filter by event icon or something like that. That looks like all the new ones that I can see anyways. And the rest of the stuff, like new skins and skeleton skins. I can't wait to get skeleton skins for like our Morella tops and Taco Bell. Are you even Taco Bell? Are you a Taco Bell? Who are you? Yeah, Taco Bell. No, I didn't mean to pick up the vulture. Now I gotta spend forever replacing you. Uh, I don't want to deal with that right now. But uh, I meant Morella. I want to get like, I hope there's Morella skeletons. I know there's a Wyvern skeleton. <gasps> Look, we got a Capro, Capro egg. Sweet! I think that's like our second Capro egg. We'll, we're gonna start collecting those from the last episode. If you didn't see, we tamed up a couple of Capro succuses, and yeah, I haven't done much with them since that episode, actually. I haven't really been on because um, I had to reinstall like all of my Steam games. Um, my hard drive was running out of space, and it was kind of getting to the point where it needed to be replaced, so I got a new hard drive just for my games, and I had to reinstall everything. So that's why, uh, like, I didn't have an episode yesterday or Thursday, and I'm not going to have an episode Friday, which is when I'm recording this, um, because obviously the update didn't launch till today. Look at those pretty colors. Let's grab an RG. Okay. Wait. I keep saying that. I keep saying let's grab an RG, and then I keep saying wait. I need a table where I can place some pumpkins, and I think we're going to use this table right here because we made the chemistry bench, so we don't really need these mortars and pestles anymore. They aren't doing anything, so I think we're going to place, like three pumpkins on this table instead, and we'll carve them all out for, um, yeah, the Halloween event. It'll be fun. And we'll leave these two mortar and pistols there just in cases. Hmm. Okay, now we can grab an RG. For realsy this time. Okay, I gotta go out this way. And then we can go start taking a look at what's what. That's the wrong way. I haven't been on in so long I forgot how to move around my base. Let's take Speedy McChicken or Godspeed. Which one do you use faster? 215%. 222%. We're taking you. Let's roll. Let's go take a look at these trees first. <gasps> Amazing new colored trees. Okay. That's pretty cool. And the dodo wyvern is prop. Whoa. Where are you guys coming from? Is this like... Okay. I wonder if there's a pumpkin patch near me. Is there a pumpkin patch around? How do I tell where the pumpkin patches even are? Maybe they are... 
I want to say they might be random, but I want to say they might be... What if there's desert pumpkin patches? Are you a desert pumpkin patch? No. But it looks like all the colors changed on the bushes as well. That's new. Hmm. Where are these fire things coming from? I hope I don't fly over here and it's coming from the dodo wyvern. Whoa! Look at the color of this mantis. Oh, you can't see. Okay. Oh, please don't fly up at me. Okay, look at this red colored mantis. Whoa, you are really cool. I want that so bad. I could get it, but it would be a waste of a horn, I think. Is there any pumpkin patches near? I wish there would be a pumpkin patch near so I don't have to go that far to get, like, some Halloween stuff. Hmm. I'm gonna have to do some exploring, but let's find out where we can see where these comet things are shooting from. Hopefully not the dodo wyvern. Also, I hope I can outrun the dodo wyvern. I want to try and kill the dodo wyvern so bad, but I think if I attack it with all of our wyverns and all of our argies, that they might die. But, I think we're going to enlist the help of some of our server members, um, some of our buddies, and they're going to use some of their dinos as well, and we're all going to- I'm going to save the server, and what we're all going to do is try and attack it as one big group. Um, we're going to like, we're in an alliance, so our dinos shouldn't injure each other, and see if we can take it out and get the uh, dodo wyvern mask. Okay, these are just coming from, it looks like, off the map. I think, just like out and yeah, randomly. Okay, I got it. Ooh, look up, uh, candy corn. I forgot about the candy corn drops. Let's see if there's anything special in the drops. I know for like the arc anniversary, there are special like, um, birthday cakes? Not birthday cakes, but um, something special in the drops. A Parasaur saddle, wow, amazing. That's not new at all. Hmm, all right, I'm gonna do some exploring and when I find a pumpkin patch, I'll bring you guys back. Whoa, look at this forest, you guys. I didn't find a pumpkin patch yet, but I was just flying through this forest area and it looks so cool with all the new like red colored trees. I know it's like the most minor of like changes that you could possibly do, but it like just makes the desert not so deserty. It just looks, it looks, it reminds me of like the island sort of. So it's just like a pretty little thing that I wanted to show you guys. And I've been flying around for like 10 minutes or so and I have yet to find a pumpkin patch. I don't know if I can see them better if it's like dark because I know there's like with the event there's longer nighttime cycles and it's daytime right now but I'm I'm hoping they like glow in the dark so I can see them a little bit better because they might just be blending in with the landscape and I'm flying right past them or something but I think they look kind of like ooh purple drop purple uh I was gonna say purple unicorn drop it's not a unicorn drop it's a candy corn drop let's go see if there's anything special in this purple one Oh, look at- Is that a dodo wyvern? It doesn't look like one. Whoa. Whoa, you're going too fast. Slow down there. Okay, that looks just like a Oh, look! Pumpkins! I found a pumpkin patch! Oh my gosh. It's right next to a drop. Okay, they do- How did I not even see that when I was flying down? I, like, didn't see it till I was right on top of it. Let's steal all the things! Can I take you? Can I grab you? Added two scarecrows! I can harvest the scarecrows. This is amazing. Give me your scarecrows. How heavy are you? Okay, they're four weight each. That's not bad. Let's harvest some of these pumpkins. If I can recall, last year these pumpkins weighed a mazillion pounds. Okay, they got rid of like the mazillion pound pumpkins it looks like. Let's collect some more of those. Please don't come over here, Lightning Wyvern, and annihilate my face off. I just want to get some of these pumpkins. Okay, I don't need that many pumpkins unless they're used for a recipe. Which I didn't even check. We gotta go check our uh, cooking pot and see what recipes we got going on. Thank you for all the pumpkins. Oh, we gotta steal some tombstones as well. Before we go back, we have to find a pumpkin patch with some tombstones. Oh, there's some more scarecrows. I need all the decorations for the base. Please. Okay, how much do we have now? 23 pumpkins? Let's get 25 pumpkins. 25 pumpkins, okay. Let's drop the weight off on you, and we'll go and search for... Huh, some tombstones. Whoa, 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 whoa. You stay in your own little area, mister. Oh, here's another thing. Does this one have tombstones? No, just more scarecrows. I'll take more scarecrows though. We can always use the scarecrows. So we can. I wonder if they light up at night. They probably do. They look like it. That'll be amazing. We'll put them next to like all of our front doors and stuff. Oh, I'm so excited about the littlest things. I don't know why, but I just love the events. I always love the events, uh, like the Christmas events and the Halloween events and like the what was it? Valentine's Day event and the birthday event. I just love all the events because it brings something new to the game. And besides dinos, it's like new items and like limited time aesthetic kind of stuff that I just am in love with. Oh yeah, baby. I think we hit the tombstone motherload. Check it out. And there's like fog. 
as well. There's like a pumpkin pet. These are like double, double pumpkin pet. Oh, did you guys hear that? <laughs> this is so cool. And if I remember, we can write on these tombstones after we place them as well. So we're gonna write like some cool stuff on them when we get back to the base. These are pretty heavy, actually. Let's not get too many of these. We'll get weighted down. We'll put those in. Yeah, we'll get four more. Just get four more. Two. Ooh. I just got chills. I don't know why. Let's get some of these. Get a couple more scarecrows. I get, I just want all the things. Give me all. Just give me infinite pumpkins and infinite scarecrows. And I'll just line our base with them. That's how much I want these guys right now. I wonder. I hope they don't take them away. Like last year. Like all the limited stuff. It goes away after the event. So I hope like we get to keep some of the stuff. Maybe the scarecrows or something. But I think they all disappear. Poop. But it'll still be fun. Oh, my weighted down. I am sure weighted down. Let's get rid of some of these rocks. Don't need those. Don't need that. Don't need those. Let's just carry our stuff. Wow, that's a lot of weight. Can we move now, though? Okay, we can move. We're heading back to base. I'll bring you guys back when we're ready to play with some of this stuff. And we're back at base with our load of goodies. Which one should we play with first? Let's plant some of these scarecrows. Can I carry all the scarecrows? I sure can. Let's put some, let's put some like by our front door where we usually come in. Like, ooh, spookiness. Okay, let's move Sugar Mama out of the way so we can see where we're placing this. Okay, I want one like here next to the trough. That I think that'll look pretty cool. Right here. Oh yeah, that's good stuff. Does it have any options? Just demolish. Okay, and then let's put one like, where else would be a good place? Probably like right here next to this door we come by a lot. So we'll see if we can place one here. Perfect. Okay, then we'll place one, hmm, I want one like right over here by these. Oh, these are going to look amazing at night. And then let's see if we can place some outside around the perimeter as well. Ooh, one up here might be cool. Let's put one right here, like overlooking the base. Let's see, how does that look? Oh, that'll be cool. Okay, so like right here. Oh yeah. Place is coming together. I could probably stick a pumpkin or something up there as well. well. Let's put some on like all the ridges. Let's put another one on this ridge over here. Or maybe next, just next to this building. Let's just put one like right here. So everyone gets scared away from this building. And now we'll play some. Should we play some outside or inside? Hmm. I think facing outside would look cool, but I also want to see them. Let's place a couple facing the outside, or just like in the general area. Like one up here, and then like one in front of this, and then another one about halfway down, and another one on this side. I think that'll look pretty cool. So we got four lining that side. Oh yeah! Okay, let's get an aerial view. Oh, spooky. Spooktacular. And then we'll place some tombstones there as well in a second. We'll go over to this side next to the behemoth and place a couple. What? There's a pumpkin patch right outside of our gate. How did we not see that earlier? Oh my gosh. That's like the best. I can harvest pumpkins every five seconds. Pumpkins and scarecrows galore. We're going to have them everywhere if that's the case. Another one there. And then... Oh no! Spooktacular saber! Get out of here. Okay, how many of those we have left? We still got 12 left. Now we gotta put some, ooh, one up here. Maybe two, maybe one, maybe two, I don't know. Maybe just one for now. One, like, yeah. Maybe one facing the inside of the base as well, like that. That's the closest I can get it. Okay, that looks pretty cool. I like it. And then we'll put one this way as well, on this side of the wall. Facing outward. Like that. Oh yeah. I love decorating. I don't know why. It's just fun. It looks so much... looks so cool with like just like three new items. It looks so much different, like so much better. We'll put a couple on this side. We got nine left to use. So I'll put one there. So we... 
And then we have infinite, like right side of our base. We could make a whole base out of just scarecrows. That would be crazy. Go on there. Go on there. And then we'll put some up on the ledge on this side and the ledge on the other side. And then we'll mess around with the pumpkins. Go one right. Oh no, I almost fell off. Okay. One right. Yeah. And then, as far as I know, the only way to get the, like the dino skins, like the skeleton skins, is to kill other things. Or at least on the um, the island last year, you had to kill alphas, but there's no alphas on this map except for the alpha wyvern. So I'm not sure if I have to kill the alpha wyvern to get the skins, or if I can just kill like regular wyverns to get the skins. Um, so after we do some more of this decorating, I'll probably go out with uh, one of the wyverns and start killing some things and see if we get anything special. Um, and there also should be, like, wild dinos with the skins around, so I'm thinking if I kill some of the random dinos, like the random spawns that have the skins, um, that they will drop the skins for us. Hopefully. And we'll put one last scarecrow right here in this corner. Perfect. Alright. What else do we got? We got pumpkins. Let's do three pumpkins. Do that. We'll take this inside and put them on our table. And then I think all we need is a paintbrush in order to paint or uh, carve these, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, let's see if we can get it right in the middle. Look how big these are. Boom. Oh, baby! One pumpkin. Can we fit another one? Okay. One. Two. Oh, yeah, we can fit three. Three. Oh. Hello, low Murray. Low Curly and, um... Mo, Lo? Mo? What are the three stooges' names? Larry, Curly, and Mo. Right? I was combining their names. <laughs> well, let's grab a paintbrush here. I think that's all I need, and I should be able to just paint with them without any paint, just like white. Oh, yes. Okay. I haven't painted anything in a while, so let's see. Left mouse button to paint. Shift plus la left mouse button to thick paint. Control plus right mouse button to erase. Okay, let's see if we can do, like, just the basic... A basic pumpkin. Can we do... No, it looks like we actually do need paint. Okay. Let's get some white paint. Do we have white paint? Oh, those are arrows. We have parchment colored. Cyan colored. Okay, I'm gonna take a minute and make some white paint, I think. I think just basic white should work. For these guys. And then I'll bring you guys back. And we're back! And we got some of our basic white coloring here. But before we do that, I want to show you what I found in the cooking pot. <gasps> Don't look at my safe. It's a secret. What I found in the cooking pot was a freaking clown mask! A scary freaking clown mask! It's got... Look at what it takes to craft it. Like, the 50 headstones, pumpkins, and 10 scarecrows are like, whatever. But then it takes a dodo rex mask and a dodo wyvern mask. Which means we have to kill both the dodo rex and the dodo wyvern to get a clown mask. That is crazy. That is, a, like, I don't think we're even going to be able to do that even on our unofficial server. I would be, I'm looking forward to seeing if anyone claims the $100 reward for killing it on, on, on an official server. Because they would have to have, like, a mazillion gigas to get the Dota Rex. And then there's not even gigas on the Scorched Earth maps. So you'd have to get a ton of, like, regular wyverns and stuff to kill the Dota Wyvern. Or something. I don't know how you'd take out a dodo wyvern. And I'm hoping that it alerts us um, to when one spawns. I think last year, if I remember correctly, it would say, like, the dodo rex has appeared or something on the top of the screen, and it would make, like, a weird music thing. So I'm hoping it does the same thing. Um, but I don't think it does that till it gets dark, and it won't get dark for, like, another four minutes or so. So um, we're going to go ahead and carve up our pumpkin, and then we're going to go out at night and see what's going on. Let's go ahead and put the white coloring on the brush, and then we'll smack it on the pumpkin. Now can we paint things? We'll select our white coloring. Okay, this is just going to be our basic, like, very basic pumpkin with triangle eyes. Can I draw on you? Why can't I? Oh, region one, region two. Oh, why can't we just... Wait, what? Why can't we color on you? L left mouse button to paint. I am left mouse buttoning to paint. We can only paint the regions? No, that can't be right. We need... Not demolish. 
Am I sure that we need a paintbrush to do it? I'm pretty sure. It's not letting me draw on it though. Erase. Neconite? No. Load paints? What if I just select the paintbrush? Hmm. What else would you use? I don't know. Like, do we have to do that? How do I rotate? Okay, like that. Can I draw on this side? Hmm, this is really weird. We can make a white pumpkin. I don't want to make a white pumpkin, I just want to carve the pumpkin. Well, I'm gonna figure out how to do this and I'll bring you guys back. Okay, we figured it out. We had to get a paintbrush with non-white paint. So we're gonna use our sky coloring paint that was in here. And then when we whack the thing now, it lets us draw on it. Like so. But it doesn't show up in the color of the paint. It just shows up as like regular pumpkin colored. So we're gonna cut out an eyeball there. This is weird. I don't know why the white coloring didn't work. Maybe because the white coloring is kind of like uh, an eraser of sorts. Is that a regular pumpkin eye? That looks like a regular pumpkin eye. Let's do another regular pumpkin eye, triangles. So we'll cut out our triangle eyes. And then do we give it a nose? What shaped nose does it usually have? Does it have like a small triangle nose like that? Okay, that looks fine. What color is this bud in there? It's got like a roundish triangle nose. And then should we do a creepy smiley face? We'll do like a smile there, like a big grin. And then we'll have like jagged teeth, like that, like vampire teeth. And then that looks like a happy pumpkin. That doesn't look like a scary pumpkin. Maybe we need like little eyebrows. Okay, that's a little bit scarier. Not as menacing as I would like it to be. Let's go ahead and save that. Oh, we don't want to save it. Close? Will it save? Oh yeah, baby, check it out! We got a pumpkin carved! That looks pretty good, actually. What should the other ones be? We should make one with... Okay, like these type of eyes. Like we'll have the bigger eyes like tombstone shaped and then they got like little pupils like that. And then we'll do the same for this side. Like a little tombstone shape like so. I am an artiste. Oh, there's like a little bit of a glare. I can't see the glare. Okay, and then up here. Doesn't use that much paint either, which is good. Okay, bring it back around. That looks okay, I guess. And then we'll do like a more triangular nose than the last one. Like so. Okay. And then we'll do like a straight face. Like a... And then we'll have like one tooth right here. Does that look like a tooth even? He looks like a derp. He's kind of like our derp pumpkin. Eh. Can I make like a little sm like a regular? Eh. I don't know. Do I like that? Control right mouse button is erase. Eh. I don't know. Do I like it? I'll learn to love it. I'll learn to love it. We're closing out of there. Okay, so we got like our little derp, like baby pumpkin. He's like a little baby with his little, like one little tooth. And then we got like the generic pumpkin. And then we're going to have, hmm, what should this pumpkin be? Oops, I didn't mean to do that. This one's going to be like, should it be a drawing of some sort? Should it be like a witch's hat? How do I make a witch's hat? Start with like the brim, like that. Okay, this is gonna be a miracle if I can pull this off and it'll look like a witch's hat. And then it'll be like, it goes up here and then gets to a little pointy and then goes kind of back out. That's kind of like a witch's hat, right? And then um, it kind of goes like back around that way and back around this way. That just looks like, I don't even know. I'm gonna go with it though. We got a little witch's hat there. We got, that doesn't look too bad, actually, now that I look at it. That looks like a hat. If I told you that's a witch's hat, would you think that that was a witch's hat? I would have to tell you what it was, but after you know that it's a witch's hat, it looks like a witch's hat. Doesn't it? Humor me. It's, it looks like a witch's hat. I'm just gonna go with it. Do we have more pumpkins to place? We do. Let's place some pumpkins outside our door as well. Like, right... Oh, should we do it on the inside here? Maybe do one, like... Yeah, let's do them on the inside, so every time we walk out, we can see a pumpkin. Like so, and then, where's my paintbrush? 
That's not a paintbrush. That's not a paintbrush. Five, four. Where's my paintbrush? Oh, I'm retarded. Okay, five. Let's paint this one as happy. We'll just write happy and then Halloween on the other one. Oh, that's gonna be hard to write Halloween. Happy. Happy barely fits on here. Yep. And it kind of like comes out kind of spooky because my mouse is like shaking a little bit. Okay, so happy. Okay, we're gonna have to do these like starting way over here. H. How do you spell Halloween? Ha. Two L's, right? O. W. E. E. I think we did it. N. Happy Halloween! Oh, that didn't come out half bad! Happy Halloween! Can we see it when we come out the door? Happy Halloween. I like it! That's awesome! Alright, pumpkin carving. Check! Um, we placed our scarecrows. Check. We checked out the clown mask skin that's extremely expensive. Check. What else we got going on? We gotta place some of the tombstones, but that's kind of just like placing the scarecrows. Let's do... We'll place a couple tombstones on camera, and then we'll go out in search of, like, the night stuff. Is it almost night? Why isn't it nighttime yet? It is 1823. I guess that's only, what, six something? Six o'clock? So I guess it'll get dark pretty soon. And then we can check out these guys, how they look in the dark. Where'd our bird go? Hello? Bird? Where did we land? Hello? Um... Godspeed? I could have sworn we landed outside. Did we not? Oh, there we go. Hiding over here from me. Okay, I'll grab a couple of these tombstones. And we can write names on these as well. What dinosaurs of ours have died recently? Um, Let's check in our tribe log. What's our most recent dinosaur death? We haven't had many deaths. Your electric cable. RIP electric cable. Your tribe killed brute festival. Tribe member brute festival. Oh, our Listro was killed. Our unnamed Listro. So we gotta make a tombstone for our unnamed Listro. We'll put that right here. Front and center. Because that's how important he was to me. R.I.P. Unnamed Listro. Ah, uh, there he is. And then we'll do R.I.P. Brute Festival. Because he's also the most recent thing. Thing person that died. R.I.P. Or no, let's do... Here lies Brut Festival. Ah, and then we'll do one for, let's see, where should we put another one? We'll put one like up over here. We don't have any decorations up in this area. Let's do one there. That'll say, Happy Halloween. And then we'll do one here. That says, Rest their souls. I don't know who they are, but just rest their souls. That makes no sense at all. But, it doesn't have to because reasons and I don't care. Let's put one up of, uh, on the side of here. And it says, hmm, what should we make it say? Oh, here we go. Uh, future grave of Dodo Wyvern. Oh yeah. Future grave of Dodo Wyvern. We have to go hunt that big big, big, big boy? Big boy? Bad boy? I tried to combine words there. I tried a lot of combining of words today and it's just not working out for me. Ah. Okay, breathe. Oh no, it's the end of the world! The meteors are coming to destroy us all. I'm having a lot of fun with this Halloween update. Even though they didn't include very much like new stuff, I'm still having a lot of fun with it. Better than if they didn't do an update at all, right? Like, I, was, I read the forums, people complaining about, like, tons of different stuff, and, like, you're just happy that they didn't update at all, okay? Some, most games, they don't even have, like, Halloween-themed events. I know, like, Overwatch that we've been playing had a uh, themed event, but any other game that I've been playing does not have a Halloween event. So, consider yourselves lucky that we get to carve pumpkins and do all this cool stuff that we don't usually get to do. And have fun with it. And I'll bring you guys back when it's nighttime, and we'll do some more Halloween stuff. Whoa, look, I just noticed that the obelisks are different colors. Like, the red one is now orange, and, like, the green one 
is now like a spookier type green on the other side of this that I noticed. And then like our blue one is now like whitish. Yeah. Oh, look, that graphical glitch though. 